we'll visit back here a little later on. Hi, this is Jason with Spalding Decon here in Tampa. Today we're at a hoard that's a little bit different than most. It's more of a collector's hoard. So we're, you're going to see a lot of NASCAR memorabilia, a lot of old cars as you see, uh, some signs, some of the stuff you see on shows like Pickers, this place is full of. So we're going to go in here. We're going to be here probably the next four or five days doing this. There's quite a lot of stuff. So join us and follow us through our journey through the show here.
put them all over there. Okay. Hi, this is Jason with Spalding Decon here in Tampa, and today we're on day two of our collector's hoard. So, as you can see the cars are still here, and as we go inside, you're going to see we're starting to move some of the collectibles out. We got a liquidation house coming to get them for for the customer to help them get some money back on those things. We're going to be going through and getting some more of the collectible stuff to the side for them, and moving out the trash and the stuff they don't need. So, come on, follow us as we continue day two. Uh, Look at this. And see what's behind it. All right, we'll visit back here a little later on. This room is done. Same thing with this one here. Be on the lookout for that. Yeah. So just be on the lookout for that. Okay, today is day three. We are tackling the garage today. We had a lot to get done. We have been moving fast, which is good. So we did the left side yesterday. We got everything pulled out and we, you know, deciphered between what he wanted to keep, what he didn't want to keep, and then we put it all back. So today we're doing the right side. It's a lot of stuff. Everything is about this high, probably 
six feet, seven feet. I'm a good. I'm almost six feet, and it's way higher than me. I can't even see over it. So that's gonna be fun today. Hopefully, we can get to the back side of the pool. Somebody should be coming to cut the grass and the weeds down because we can't really get through there holding the stuff because it's like it's, it's thick bush. We can't get through that. So we're waiting on that. Once that get done, we're gonna get in the pool area, and that's gonna be fun. So see you then. Look at that. Oh, that's up, that's up. You might well open the side. She's sitting up there nice and like So Some will pop out.
looks like all of this has to get back into here. What's that? Mean? This is our swamp that we're working on today. The goal is to get all of this pushed out. My plan for it is to start from this door and make my way out. We basically just gotta pull things out inch by inch because we don't really have much room to walk or somebody gonna be in the water. So just slowly take everything out and place it in the garage or even throw it in the dump trailer because they are planning to keep some of the stuff, but not everything. So yeah.
Day four is coming to a close. Finishing up this last load of the trailer. And then we'll be out. Hey, I'm Tim. This is uh, day five on this horde we got going on. We got the uh, Pool area, Lanai done yesterday. We got the garage done. We got the inside of the house cleaned up. Today we're going to be starting on this thing, which is filled top to bottom. It's going to take pretty much all day and maybe some of the day tomorrow. But it should be our last thing we got to do and we'll be have this job wrapped up. Uh, hopefully you've uh, paid attention and watched what we've done before. And you can see the ending and our finished product. Thank you for watching. this tram Finish, but they go on the Freaking stupid.
you specifically for help. Jason with Spalling Decon in Tampa. We're here on our final day for now of our, of our collector's hoard here. Um, there's going to be a liquidation company coming in next. They're going to sell off a lot of these items that are here. Um, there is value in a lot of this stuff that's here. So they're going to get the homeowners what they can. And then after that they'll call us in and we'll take what's left and we'll haul it off to the, to the landfill. So, um, so for now we're done with the collector's hoard. We've been here six days and we're ready to move on to the next job. Don't miss out on this amazing opportunity. Visit our website at spaldingdecon.com or give us a call at 866-99-DECON to learn more about becoming a franchisee. Let's build a brighter future together. Thank you for tuning in, everyone. Here's to a clean start with Spalding Decon. For more information, visit any of our locations. That's it guys, on to the next.